Well, we have something right here. It looks like whatever it is, it's right in front of it. It's dead ahead of us. So let's check it out. Let's see what we have. Oh. Whatever it is, it looks nice. Unfortunately, I also see... Reeklings. It's never a good day when I see Reeklings. They're not hostile, though. That's a little strange. That's a little odd. If they won't attack me, I won't attack them. But I'm a bit perplexed by this. Hi there. You follow me. Excuse me? Did you just speak? Who taught you to talk? You follow me. Okay, stop bouncing up and down and I'll follow you. In charge of a meat hall, they've taken over a meat hall, and they can speak. <laughs> hello, is that your attempt at saying hello? It, it could use a little bit of work, but, you know, it's coming along decently. Now, do more of you speak? Or is it really just a couple of you? Oh, you're, uh... You're dancing a little bit, too. You can talk, you can dance, you can do everything, can't you? You follow me. Yep, still working on it. Still doing that. You follow me. I'm, yeah, I'm doing my best. Where are you taking me? You follow me. Alright, I'm... I'm aware that I am following you. You strong help drive him. I... Excuse me? Who are you? You, you, strong. Yes, thank you. Help, oh, okay, all right. Well, I am strong. Thank you for noticing. <laughs> How did you learn to talk? Chief, smart. Most likely dumb, but chief, smart. I'll give you that. We, family, we, strong. You, stronger. I'll give you that, too. Are you saying you need my help? Bilkamak, run. Prize beast, run. Bull tribe kin, chase away. Bilgamuk, fear. What is a Bilgamuk? He follow you, yes. What? Bilgamuk is an animal of some kind, and you want me to bring it back? Bilgamuk, prize beast, you find. He follow. I. Bilgamuk, love meat. I mean, same. He meat, he follow. You go. Brevik. You have any meat I can borrow? Go find Bilgamuk. I, okay. Listen, this is all just a little bit strange for me. Where did you live before you were here? Tribekin live all places, all of world, within great water. Are you saying that the entire world is on this island? I've got bad news for you. Why did you take over this meat hall here? Hot, fire, cold, dizzy drink. Happy tribe. I mean, you know what? I understand that. I can, uh, I can absolutely understand that. You know, I, I can understand that. I can relate to that. Maybe we're not so different. Minus most of your kind always trying to murder me. So this is my life now. Helping Reeklings. Where shall we journey next? You have any... <laughs> you have any feelings on this? Let us go. Anything to say? Because I can't say I'm necessarily a big fan of Reeklings. These ones aren't attacking me. These ones aren't hurting me, which is a nice change of pace, but... I mean, for how long can I really uh, trust them after all? Just because they can speak doesn't mean that we're going to get along very well. Hello? Bilgamuk? Come on, boy, I've got something for you. Do you like clams? Oh, he does like clams. <laughs> I mean, you like clams, I like clams. You don't speak. 
you don't talk, but uh, maybe we'll get along too. They took over Therisk Mead Hall. I'd like to know who they took it over from. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh. Just some wolves? That's fine. Oh, did I miss? No, I got him. I got him. I thank you for your protection, Armaker. Mainly doing this for the, uh, the souls. Mainly doing this just because I still want to raise my conjuration as much as I possibly can. Belvic. No, not Belvic. Bilgamuk. See, I brought you your, um, your bristle back. You're very, very welcome. Let's just get him over to the pen. Let's just get him back to where he belongs. Let's make your chief happy. Why am I making your chief happy? I'm not entirely sure yet. I'm not entirely clear. And this is a little weird. This is all a little strange to me. Right now, I'm just along for the ride. Bilgamak, follow you. Bilgamak, no strength. Thank you, your... Reclingness. Uh... You know... I know this whole talking thing is new to you, but we have this word called please. You might want to use it sometime. I'm not getting paid for this at all. What What do you need help with? What else do you need me to do? Dreykin, missing Red Cross. Need for God speak, dance. Oh, you're not strong enough for that? You bring Red Cross. We dance. What is this Red Cross? Am I just getting you drugs? Am I your dealer now? Yeah. Like this, go pray to hands of Red Cross, be friend of Tribe King. Oh, Scathecraw. I mean, I am familiar with Scathecraw. I use it in my alchemy. How much do I have right now? Oh, I... Okay, I have enough. <laughs> I have more than enough. Wonder, gather. Here I am. Here's your red grass for the god speak. Good, Red Cross. Later, we burn. Now, final task. Mm-hmm. Then, you try to give. Oh, thanks. This is what I wanted, yeah. What do we need to do now? Bad Nords say, there's bears. Live by water. Bother, tribe kid. Wait. We fight. You strong. You help. No more bad Nords. You want me to kill the Nords? Who you kicked out of Thirsk Mead Hall for. You want me to kill the original inhabitants who you stole this from? Bad people, they come fight us. We fight back now. I don't know about this. You know, we know. Come fight. We wait, but you come fight. Can I go and find them? I want to go find these Nords if I can. He said they live down by the water. I'm not necessarily sure in what direction, but I'm hoping I might be able to find them. Maybe if I could hear their side of this, although really it does just sound like the Reeklings barged in, took over, and kicked them out. And the Nords are just trying to get their home back. Won't be that easy to get rid of the Reeklings, Kulvar. Yep. I never said it would be, but either way, we have to try. Whether we succeed or not, it'll stir up some of the old blood in this crowd. I'm not going to lead them to their deaths if they aren't ready. Then train them. What are we doing here? We should either get used to staying here or be preparing to retake the hall. You're, you're asking for either. trouble walking around with dangerous it. magic like that. But your stomach isn't my problem. We'll act when I say we do, and not before. Well, you'd better say something. And soon. Hi. Maybe I could be of some assistance. You keep your distance with that magic. Hey, this magic could save your life. What's going on here? What's going on here is that we've been kicked out of our home. The Mead Hall. Up there on the hill, we were... Some Reeklings have taken it over. How were the Reeklings able to overpower you? 
with tenacity and numbers. It didn't help that we'd grown a little too comfortable up there. Too much mead, too many stories, too few battles. Is that a dog over there? Is that your dog by any chance? I, I guess not, he's running away. What if you had an extra warrior? Are you offering to help? I mean, it is... Some new blood should be enough to rouse these layabouts to actually fight again. We're talking about your ancestral home, right? <clears throat> Aye. Right? Can I talk to a couple of people here? Can I learn more about the history of this mead hall, maybe? That spell looks like it'll hurt. Oh, it will. What is Thirsk? What Do now? you know of I the skull? Make sure you were all right. Of course, your the village to nobody. the north. It's a long time ago, a man named Hrothmund left the skull to form his own tradition. See, Warriors in the wild, matters. living like the Nords of old. The they would hunt, they would battle. fight, and the mightiest among them would now. rise up as leader. But those days hunter, are behind us now. Well, what brings you out here? We brought ourselves out here, along with our shame. What do you mean? We used to be proud warriors of Thirsk Mead Hall. There, up on the hill. But we let that sweet life get the better of us. We grew soft and... Well, what happened? Reeklings. Those filthy vermin. They came in numbers. Waves of the things. One at a time. They're pests. But with this many. And so here we are, out of our home. You know, I feel bad for you guys. This was your ancestral home, and it sounds like your only crime is that you just got comfortable and weren't really warriors anymore. Until next time. No, it sounds like uh, you might need my help. That spell looks dangerous. Oh, it is. But it could be on your side. People seem pretty tense around here. You don't know the half of it. Bujul's just embarrassed, I think. Doesn't help that her husband is one of the loudest complainers. She's always been quick to shame. Who's her husband? Kuvar. Oh. He thinks we've all gotten a little too soft. I can see what he means looking at Elmas, but the rest of us still have our edge. At least, I think so. And don't tell Elmas I said that. Oh, well, I might. So you're one of the warriors from Thirsk, then? That depends on who you ask. I fight, I protect the hall, I bring in meat. And I think I could take on most of the tree lovers up in the Skull Village. But because I'd rather drink a mug of meat at night instead of training until I drop, Kuvar calls me a layabout. Wish he would just lighten up. Good day. Where's this Elmas? I want to know, uh, if he really has let himself go. You keep your distance like with you that magic. Like you seem to claim. Oh! You probably heard her. That spell looks dangerous. Keep your distance. Listen, back on the mainland, well, I'm something of a mage. Sure right. I'm also a mage here, technically. Nobody. Are you the it's one who makes fault. the mead? There were too many of them. I nobody make it, I drink it, Don't I share it with friends. I like you already. Thirsk didn't always make its own mead. No, we used to get by on shipments from Skyrim. Like but those now, gold grubbers at the East Empire Company started charging more than their share for bringing it over. We still buy what we have to, but I make as much as I can. I would like to try that, then. Is there anything that would, uh, make being down here a little bit more bearable? Well, the easy answer, of course. Me! Of course. Actually, now that I think of it, I have been missing the Ashfire. It's a special brew that we make at Thirsk. Oh? If you could somehow get up there and grab a bottle, I'd be a long way towards forgetting how miserable it is down here. I... So hard on Elmas? Okay, because I guess. I could also help you in retaking the hall, you know? I wouldn't be at Thirsk if I wasn't. Not everything mm. is These days I focus a little more on the creature comforts of the hall, though. The food, the drink, the stories. It drives Kuvar mad, but someone has to do it or the place would be a little... cold. Alright. Farewell. Hello. You're asking for trouble walking around with dangerous magic like that. Yeah, I've heard it before. You're asking for trouble walking around with dangerous magic like that. And it seems I'll hear it again. happy as you do. I'm gonna see if I can find him a bottle of that meat. I hope it's not stealing. But I'm gonna see if I can find it. 
feel a little bit more sympathetic towards the warriors of Thirst Call. Maybe it's all the Reeklings that I've killed. Maybe it's because I keep on having to fight Reeklings in bulk that I don't feel as bad for the Reeklings in Thirst Call, but... You know, I, I feel a little kinship towards the Norris, or at least I feel more kinship for them than I do for the weird little blue buggers. Now, if someone could just show me to the mead. I just want to know where you keep it. I just want to know where it is. Why do I have the feeling that they're going to be hiding it? They're not going to make this easy. I'm not going to be able to just walk up to a table and get mead. Do they even have tables? They have one. They have a singular table, it would seem. Can't just pick up the barrels. That'd be too easy. Oh, oh, oh. Here we go. And it's not stealing, either. I'm just gonna take a few. You didn't seem to care. You didn't seem to notice. So, uh, yeah. I'll just be leaving with these, if you don't mind. Why are you so hard on Elmas? A new batch of the Ashfire should be himself. ready for bottling soon. Unless the Reeklings used it for bathwater. Not everything is as Well, I found you some uh, good old Ashfire Mead. No bath water. I promise. Oh, that's the stuff, all right. What You're now? a good friend to, to Thirst and to me. Right. I thank you. Your worry helps nobody. Wow, where did you have 1,200 gold stashed nobody away? Did. It's been good you talking to you. Know? It's got to be the most matters. expensive bottle of mead I've ever seen. I'm going to go seen. down as the unworthy because of that rabble. You don't have to live like this now, though. Unless you're ready to go fight those things, just leave me. Don't worry. Just leave us, No, I'm please. here to help. Good to finally be getting some sleep at night. Things are, are bad enough without everyone time? around here looking death-eyed, too. I, uh, I hadn't planned on it. Have you been Do you need my exiled? No, I wouldn't call it that. We've just got a bit of an infestation, is all. Down here to catch our breath? And then we'll be back in the hall once I get the rest of these up to move. How long have you been down here? Longer than I would have liked. That's not an answer. That's really not helpful. I would like to know an actual time frame. Weeks? Months? A year? Two years? What are we talking here? Some new blood should be enough to rouse these layabouts to actually fight again. I'm here to help. I'm here to help you take back the meat hall. Well, let's move then. Hey, you lazy milk drinkers, get over here. I'm gonna stand behind her, she's not talking to me. I know you're all starting to settle in here and keep up the fat lives you've got used to up in the hall. Freya, you don't need to stand there and but take look this. Here. This outsider has more fire than any of you. Freya, too. All I had to do was mention our little infestation, and he volunteered in a second. I don't want to have my spirit outstripped by some wanderer, so let's get up there and kill us some Reeklings. I also realized that I came here saying, oh, well, they're Nords, so Freya would appreciate this, but... As it is, they uh, made it clear that they weren't fans of the Skull. It's like, oh, we left the Skull because they're tree people, tree worshippers. Listen, no one's taking over uh, the Skull Village is all I'm saying. They've done plenty fine on their own, even with, you know, the stones being taken over and all. Now, I have to that? make sure that I don't accidentally hit any of the Fierce Warriors. Alright, and you're gonna hear all of the terrible, crunchy noises. See, that's the one reason I would have sided with them, just so I don't have to hear the crunchy noises. Ugh. Ugh, just makes me gag a little bit every single time. Oh, there's a lot going on. Oh, okay. I'm just gonna stand here for a moment. I just want to make sure I don't hurt any of my friends, any of my allies. Guys, the, the Reeklings are over there. I, I, I can help. I can move in. I will assist in the fight. 
You're making me angry. Oh, is that the chieftain right there? I think so. That looks like him. I'm just holding everyone back. Oh, and... Oh, there's just the chief left now. There he is. I found him. Sorry, he looked a lot like the other weaklings. Can I talk to him? I can't. Okay. Well, it wasn't an honorable fight. But I've killed many, many more weaklings, so maybe I'm not really one to talk. Ah, uh, that was almost exhilarating. Almost, How are you feeling? Yeah. <laughs> I feel fine. That was easy. Good to hear. In fact, that's just the spirit I'll need from my second. Do you want to come with me? Your second? Your what? My second. If we're going to take up residence here again, I need to get the blessing of Rothmund again. I'll need a witness and, well, you see the kind of horker brains I deal with around here. What do you say? Sure, I'll join you for this. Well, let's not waste time talking about it then. You lead the way, I'll be there in a moment. You guys have a lot of cleaning up to do here, so, uh, you know, up to it. Maybe make this place look a little bit more presentable by the time we get back. So where exactly is the Barrow? Oh, she is, she's gone. I was right behind her and she left. Frothman's Barrow. Alright, we'll be there in a little bit. It's just a slight walk. I told her I'd go with her. I told her I would join her. Oh, okay, there you are. You haven't left yet. Sorry, it, it looked like you had. I'm sorry for saying that you ran off without me. You can see why I was under that impression. Is that it? Right there? It's not much of a barrow. It's just, you know, a cave entrance. Is it more impressive on the inside? I'm hoping it might be a little bit more impressive on the inside. Are you ready to go inside? I was born ready. What is this place? The burial place of Rothmund, who founded Thursk. He brought a group of true warriors away from the soft life of the Skal to know the wilderness, to feel the sting of cold and of steel. I think the Skal know, know that more that than you. Sounds a little silly. It's just the way it's written in the books, and that phrase has always stuck with me. What's gonna happen in there? It's pretty simple. Rothmund's axe is in there with him. Anyone who attempts to take hold of it has their spirit judged by Rothmund himself. We're gonna fight his ghost? No, no, nothing like that. He doesn't need to battle us to know us. He's always watched over Thursk and sees us from beyond. And in my case, since he's already deemed me worthy, it will just be a matter of him remembering why he blessed me before. Mm. Really. All you need to do is watch. Okay. All right, I'm ready. Let's not waste any time, then. You're very sure that you're worthy. I have news for you. They call you the unworthy. I just don't necessarily know if this is going to go the way that you think it's going to. I want to know what kind of magic Rothman knew. That he, as a ghost, as a spirit, can watch over all of Thursk for time immemorial. That's impressive. I don't know many magics like that. I don't know how you go about that. If I was told I had to pick a place to watch over as a ghost for time immemorial, I don't know where I would pick. I don't know what I would choose. I'd be a very indecisive ghost. Kind of like me now, when I'm still alive. Impressive. Yeah. Huh? What, what, huh? What are you confused by? You said you've been here before. I don't know how much I trust her. I don't know how much I like her. That's all I'm saying. Thank you. 
There it is. So I just need to take hold of it. All right. You seek my blessing for the leadership of Thirsk Hall? I do. It is I, Bujold. You blessed me in the past, and now I've rid the Hall of Reeklings and returned it to its rightful owners. And well it is that this has happened. But I have always watched, and know that it was your softness that led to your own exile. You no, allowed your fellow I... warriors to grow weak, while the dangers around you mounted. Then... the leadership is not mine? No. Nor is there any among you fit to serve. For a band in the wilderness, it is better to have no leader than a poor one. Oh. That was a little embarrassing. I'll say. How are you feeling about that? Ashamed, but I guess that was the point. I need to return to Thursk. No matter what Rothman says, we need a leader, and I'm still the best person for that. You would go against Rothman's wishes? And look what's happened to us so far under his watchful eye. He gave his blessing to all the leaders who brought us to this point. And he rescinded that. Anyway, he's dead and we're alive. It's time to begin a new tradition for Thursk, and I'm going to do that. All I need is for you to back me up. You don't even need to lie. Just don't tell anyone else what you heard here. Where is your honor? I can't let you lead, not with that attitude. I was afraid you might say that. Well, looks as though I'll have to prove my mettle against you now. Oh no. What? We don't have yeah. to fight. We, <gasps> we don't have to fight. Uh, ah! Also, you couldn't take on the uh, Reeklings without oh, me, and now you. you think that you can beat us? I haven't even landed a hit yet, so... I am sorry, but you left me with no choice. Maybe I shouldn't have said anything before I actually attacked. Oh, Bujold the Intrepid. Perhaps that somehow made her worthy? Oh, I can't grab it. I wanted to hold it. I wanted to hear what he had to say about me. Who knows? Maybe he would have deemed me worthy. How do things go out there? Where is Bajold? It's not that simple. She was rejected by Hrothmund himself. Are you serious? How... How did she take it? Uh, not well. She attacked me and I had to defend myself. Ah, uh, I see. I hope she fought well. Was it... Did Rothmund recognize anyone else? Nope. Was it you? Mm, Is that nope. why? He said the next Thirsk Chief is a long ways off. Well then, I'll do my best to keep the hall together until that day comes. Now look... I understand you were just defending yourself, and because you helped us retake the hall, I'll look past it this once. But I wouldn't show my face in here again if I were you. Do we understand each other? Yeah. I'll stay out of your way. See that you do. Not one of my best <laughs> adventures. Let's get out of here. Maybe we'll go back to Raven Rock. I feel a lot more welcomed back there.